a lot of things have happened in my four years with the program getting cut and COVID. And so it's definitely a very unique situation. I think if it had been a linear four years, maybe I would have been ready to move on. But with the opportunity to do a co-term in sustainability and to change my point of study a bit and kind of expand to a more high level and worldly view in terms of my academics, I was really excited about that. And with the team, it's fun to I feel like I've seen Stanford field hockey at its highest and at its lowest. And in the last two years, I think we've started from the ground. We've built our culture. We've set an awesome foundation. And I really wanted to be able to share that with um, the new incoming freshmen and to tell them like who we are, this is what we stand for, and to um, get back out there one more time and really put our culture in front of us and just take that step forward. So my sophomore year, I think a lot of what I'm doing started from a project that I did then. So I spent a quarter and I was researching the sustainability of the Stanford Field Hockey Program specifically. And I, conduct, I did conduct a lot of interviews. Um, I talked to my coaches, I talked to my teammates, I talked to the nutritionists, the athletic trainers, um, the laundry staff, lots of people. And I learned a lot. Um, and one of the things that I found super exciting was that we're doing a lot of things that are really sustainable that people don't know about. As, a, like, as an athlete, I wasn't aware. But there's also a lot of room for work. And I did research on what other schools are doing as well. So that informed recommendations that I gave in my final report for that project. And I think something that I want to do going forward is to have team specific goals and projects. But I'd love to pilot a program with the field hockey team to see, to have bring in speakers to our locker room. So it's a very intimate environment. We can ask questions. We can really learn a lot, but also have monthly focus such as, okay, we're going to do meatless Mondays this week, or we're going to reduce our shower time by X number of minutes. So just little things that can change that we can do in our daily life that when we do it together, will make an impact. Student Athletes for Sustainability is a group of students who are all really passionate about working together and working to make Stanford athletics more sustainable and also get sustainability education out to the student athlete community. So we do all different things. We have a class called Sustainability in Athletics where we discuss how you can make both make sporting operations more sustainable but also use them to have a community impact much beyond the field and like the different events. We also have put compost and recycling bins in all of the locker rooms. We work to make athlete dining more sustainable, having compostable silverware. We have different gear and shoe drives and to give them to local partners. And there's different student athlete groups at Stanford uh, beyond student athletes for sustainability. So we get to partner with them, such as the community service group. And we can have beach cleanups um, or community gardening projects, which is great because it's helping the community and it's also promoting sustainability. In terms of goals for me, I'm still trying to figure that that out. Sustainability is a really new space and there is so much opportunity but it's a bit unknown. I'm like where do I fit in? What roles even exist? I think something that interests me a lot is social sustainability and how organizations function and how teams work because I feel like you can't make sustainable change if you don't have sustainable operations. You need the people who are working on these projects to feel like they are connected, like their well-being is in a great place. I think that it's really cool that Stanford gives its student athletes the platform and the space to make change both on campus and off campus. I feel very supported in my role and I feel like there's a lot of energy behind me. There are people who want to make our, our ideas a reality and that's really inspiring.